Hi folks, Nathaniel here at Chicago Music Exchange and today we are delighted to be finally carrying copper sound pedals out of Massachusetts and uh, we've got quite an array of pedals here. I'm going into this blind. Uh, I don't know what I do. Uh, we're going to find out. Uh, it's going to be genuine. It's going to be fun. First up we got the Captain Hook, which is a fuzz pedal. <laughs> Let's play around a little bit. Let's do a little bit of the boost. I'm gonna turn this on as well. Chaos, about to happen. Pretty cool. I do like that. Uh, we got the fox catcher. Unfortunately, we do a lot of that back in England. Anyway, that's a different story. As you see, volume, tone, we're all roughly around 12 o'clock. Nature, I'm intrigued to see what that is. Uh, let's turn the drive back uh, around 12 o'clock, see what happens. So quite a nice, just overdriven kind of sound. Let's turn up, let's go with the drive. Let's turn it off a little bit, so at three o'clock. Let's kick in. Now we're on the foxtail, as you can see. We've got a bomb. So the bomb's about to go off. Here we go. Let's turn up a little boost. Drive up a little bit and see how that sounds. Now that's kind of moving more into heavier territory, a little bit lead sound. A lot of fun, that one. Right, let's move on to Diedless, Deadless. Forgive me if I'm saying that wrong. Uh, but we've got a reverb pedal. Now, I do love a good reverb pedal. The more reverb, the better for me, in certain cases, uh, for the hell of it. Everything up, just see how that sounds. Highly unlikely that you're ever gonna do this. Um, but why not? Let's see. Right, let's check out these two combined. It kind of makes sense to have the reverb and the overdrive together, see how that sounds. Uh, here we go. That sounds pretty good. Uh, nice little combo of those two. Uh, now we've got the Polaris, and this is a chorus and vibrato pedal. Uh, I'm gonna turn everything around 12. See how that sounds. So here we go. good. Uh, let's check out, let's go to the full moon, full moon, half moon, total eclipse. Anyone get that one? Hopefully. Next one. Uh, so we're going on focus, quite high up on both. I'm going to turn the right a little bit and the tone. Uh, let's hear this. Crazy, a little bit of fun I suppose. It's up to you whether you'd use it. Very messy there. Don't, don't go with the low chord. A bit wacky that. Uh, a little bit too much for me personally. So I'd probably bring that back. Maybe go back to full moon. Now that's nice, I like that. I really like that set, that's quite nice. Right, next one up, we've got the Lomo Creator. Uh, so this is a trem pedal and a little bit of overdrive as well. 
Let's have a uh, quick blast. <laughs> Let's change it up a little bit. Let's change it to uh, lo-fi. Bring the rate up a little bit more. Depth back to about 12. Change the S, this time we've got the square one. Here we go. That's got Green Day written all over it, right? rendition but you get the, IP, uh, the idea there so another good sounding pedal I do like the combination of the uh, the overdrive with it you know for the hell of it I might not get this opportunity again I'm gonna do all of them prepare yourself for an ungodly mess are we sure we want to do this John My ears have gone after that. Um, right, so a lot of fun. Obviously, highly unlikely you're ever gonna do that. Probably not recommended, although that wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. My favorite out of the bunch, I am partial to a reverb pedal, uh, in all honesty. Do like the reverb, I do like the chorus. On the whole, good fun pedals. Um, some cool kind of artwork on the front. Uh, good hardware on the outside. Make sure you come and check them out. Um, maybe we'll have this set up so you can create this wacky noise all at once. Um, but yeah, check them out, lots of fun. Mm.